welcome to the Valder BB Show as we broadcast live on a global platform here from Dallas, Texas. Welcome, Dr. Peterson. Hi, thank you for having me. Thank you. What do you know that we need to know? Uh, what, what do I know that you need to know? Well, the most important thing is to take good care of yourself as the winter approaches. And one thing that people often tend to neglect is, believe it or not, their dental care. And you can have early tooth and gum damage that can occur before you even know it exists. So I have some recommendations for our listeners. Number one, see your dentist twice a year for a cleaning. Brush your teeth twice a day, floss every day, and use the right toothpaste. And I recommend Colgate Total Daily Repair Toothpaste because it helps reverse and repair early tooth and gum damage. It reverses gingivitis, and it also keeps your breath fresh, of course, and it remineralizes your enamel, which strengthens your teeth, and it continues to work even after you brush. So it's an important tool for your overall care of your mouth. Dr. Peterson, that's a good question. I love Colgate, been a Colgate user all my life, okay? But the aisle is so vast. How do you know the right Colgate toothpaste for you? I know there's a lot of choices in the aisle. You just have to read the packaging carefully. Colgate Total, Daily Repair. Just try to commit that to memory. It's been on the shelves in your local pharmacy for several months now. So hopefully it's easy to find for everybody. It is. It's easy to find among the other Colgate kinds of SKUs on the products. But, you know, choosing Colgate is always the best way to go. I, that's all I've used. Okay. So I find out my dentist is doing more. Let's talk a little bit more about finding these problems that we have. You know, my dentist is doing everything from taking my blood pressure <laughs> to asking me about my medical history. Why the change in dental procedure in the last couple of years? Well, what we've learned is that tooth and gum damage can actually be a predictor for other problems in your body. So, for example, if you have gum recession, you can actually be more inclined to have heart disease, believe it or not. There has been some small studies that have shown a link there. And, um, and also, I just think that people tend to neglect their teeth, and they're one thing that you want to keep until really it, you, your entire life, you want to keep them very healthy. So I, I think that people tend to neglect them. I, whenever I do a physical, I ask my patients, are you flossing? And so many of them say no. And I try to remind them how important that is, that taking care of your mouth is just as important as taking care of the rest of your body. Today, my guest is Dr. Peterson, and she's a medical contributor and a columnist for Women's Health Magazines, and you've seen her on um, national TV all the time. Let me ask you, as we age, you say that there's a change and a shift. So should we be talking to our doctors about that change and shift in our body? Well, and I'm talking about the dentist. Uh, well, as we age, there are certainly markers and screeners that we need to check but you're, if you see your internist for a physical every single year, that's their job. Their job is to ask you the right questions and make sure you're getting the screening tests you need. So if you haven't made an appointment for a physical yet, um, do so this winter because don't forget it's, it's also cold and flu season, so it's important to get in there to get your checks. And certainly if you have a cold and flu, see your doctor as well if you're suffering from symptoms. And because this is the time of year, I'd love to offer some tips to our viewers as well for, for cold and flu. I'd love to hear that. There is no cure for the common cold, but there are things that you can do. At the very first sign of a cold, you can try using Coldy's Cold Remedy. It has been proven in studies to shorten the duration of your cold by almost half, which is pretty significant. And they also have a multi-symptom quick melt that is useful if you're suffering from, cold, from cough and congestion. They have added ingredients in it that will provide you with some symptom relief. And if you are suffering from a cold and flu and you're, and you're waiting for medicine to kick in and you have a fever, something that you can use for your child is Be Cool Soft Gel Sheets. They're adhesive and they provide instant cooling relief for your child and it can last up to eight hours. So it will give your child some relief of the fever in a very convenient way. 
you just put the adhesive on. It's not messy. It's disposable, so you can even carry it with you. If you have a, a fussy child, it's better than using a wet washcloth that can drip water and that warms up too quickly. So I love these options for our patient, for my patients when it comes to cold and flu symptoms. Dr. Kerry Peterson. Dr. Peterson, where would you send my audience to find out more information on the web? You can go to videopump.tv for more information on everything we talked about. Thank you so much for this morning inspiration, starting our day off right with Dr. Kerry Peterson. Thank you, Dr. Peterson. Thank you.